All right. So the CDC and other World Health Agencies have sort of boxed themselves into a corner. So there is the theoretical risk of a contact transfer, but the short answer again is it's primarily a respiratory transmission pathogen. So you're much more likely to get it in a restaurant circumstance by having people congregated nearby who are talking, coughing, sneezing, laughing, than from the utensils. The other question in my mind becomes, if we, if we recommend disposable menus, disposable utensils, disposable plates, et cetera, who is putting these on the tables? So you're still gonna have the same people who are touching now the disposables. And even if they're wrapped in plastic, like the fork, knife, spoon combos and the plastic wrap, you've now touched the plastic wrap to open it up, which was touched by the server. And so if I follow that chain of logic and causality, it's no different from having a, a, a stainless steel fork on the table that somebody's touched. And it's probably more risky because now you've got to open the cellophane, which you know, you pull out the fork maybe upside down, you've touched the tines and it's maybe then inoculated the tip of the fork, whereas if the cutlery was presumably placed on the table by the handle, you pick up the handle, sure, maybe if there's some surface transfer, but if you're using the cutlery the way it's intended, you're not transmitting that into your mouth. 